Hey guys, it's Leia. Today we will learn how to compute the derivatives of trig functions. Here are the derivatives of the trig functions. It's important to memorize them because it will help make computing derivatives faster. One thing that will help you memorize them is that the derivative of any trig function starting with the C will always be negative. Let's see our first example. We want to compute the derivative of negative 3 cotangent of x. We first use the multiplication by constant rule to pull out the negative 3. Next, we want to compute the derivative of cotangent of x, so we recall its derivative and plug that in. Now we can simplify the solution, and we will get 3 over sine squared of x as our answer. Next example, we want to compute the derivative of cosine of x times sine of x. Since we are taking the derivative of two functions multiplied together, we can use the product rule. This gives us the derivative of cosine of x times sine of x plus the derivative of sine of x times cosine of x. Next, we will compute the derivative of cosine of x first. We recall the derivative of cosine of x. This equals negative sine of x. And now we'll compute the derivative of sine of x. We recall the derivative of sine of x, and this equals cosine of x. So we can plug these derivatives back into the solution. We now simplify and get cosine squared of x minus sine squared of x as our answer. Last example, we want to compute the derivative of 5 times tangent of x minus x. We first use the sum difference rule to split the derivative into two. We will first compute the derivative of 5 times tangent of x. We use the multiplication by a constant rule and pull out a 5. Next, we recall the derivative of tangent of x, which equals secant squared of x, and we'll plug that in. This gives us 5 times secant squared of x. Next, we will compute the derivative of x. We can use the power rule, and this equals 1. And now we can plug in these derivatives back into the solution, and we'll get 5 secant squared of x minus 1, our answer. Memorization is key when computing derivatives of trig functions. Practicing problems will help you memorize these derivatives. But for more help or practice on this topic, visit www.symbolab.com and click on the Practice tab.